who do y'all think Valentine and Nina saw on the surveillance? They said, no, it can't be. I said, well, who? Who? Say a name or something. And then Anna over here calling the cops. I was like, do she think that Valentine did it or what? Because they show her having the flashbacks of everything that's happened, everything that was said, the lies that was told. And I was like, no, she didn't. I said, y'all think she calling the cops on him or what? But hey, y'all, welcome back to another review of Life with Chelsea. This is for General Hospital, September 18, 2023. Before we continue the video, y'all, I want y'all to check out the DLC Crew Text Club, and I want y'all to sign up. It's just $5. It's currently on sale for $5. The link will be in the description. You receive, you will receive four encouraging messages per month. Again, the link is in the description. It's currently on sale for $5. It's a text club, y'all. Okay, so people are speculating that it's Alex. I think I said that already, but they think that it's Alex. Somebody said Peter August, and it's a new one. Somebody said Charlotte, and they said that's why, you know, Valentine telling Nina on tomorrow's episode uh, not to show that surveillance to anyone else. And I said, I don't know. I wouldn't think they did show a man's shoes. They show a man's shoes or whatever was sitting, because they don't explain that Charlotte ain't put the hit out on her. So I'm like, uh-uh, it can't be. I mean, it could be her for that and somebody else for the other thing. But no, who y'all think it is? Like, um, would Nina be saying that if it was Alex or if it was somebody else? Look, I'm ready to see now because, look, they always got to make us wait for stuff. And then it's like they forget that they, or they forgot that they made us wait to see who it is. And then by the time they show it, it's like, we don't care no more. It's like, it's been months. It's been years. We don't care. We forgot all about that storyline. So I'm like, no, that should have ended the episode showing who it was on the surveillance look that would have been better in my opinion but i don't know coming down below what y'all think do y'all think it's alex charlotte peter august or somebody else but it gotta be somebody obviously that they know for nina nelson to say no it can't be but yeah um valentine went to nina because you know the continuation of friday's episode where they had written all over uh anna's mirror they don't destroy her hotel room and everything look these people ain't got no type of good security they breaking in the rooms <laughs> putting hit out on folks and stuff so valentine went to find out i said look i want to know what valentine hiding or whatever how is he involved in all of this because no they still ain't revealed that yet but yeah he wanted uh nina to show him the surveillance and of course they didn't show us who it was Nina was in the office talking to Lucy. Lucy came there like she wanted to know how it's going with Sasha and everything. Then it was talking about something. She needed to know if she needed to replace uh, Sasha. And look, Nina got mad. See, look, I be wanting to root for Nina and everything. But then they always got to make a storyline where she going to do something stupid. Like, I love how she been um, looking out for Sasha and everything. That's why I said, why didn't they just make it so Sasha was her daughter? Like, they could have actually made it confirmed that Sasha. But instead, they had to confirm it was Nell and it was Willow. And I think they did that. I'm assuming they did that because a lot of fans at that time when uh, they first came on the scene, they was people were speculating that they was going to be twins. And I said, I don't even think they was going with that storyline originally, but I don't know these folks' mindset. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. Well, yeah, I was like, because um, I thought they was going to say, oh, it turns out you actually are her daughter, but no. But no. Because then they also recently, uh, Sasha was talking about, you know, uh, she has nobody now because of Gladys betraying her. But yeah, now Nina Nina basically told Lucy to get out and everything. I said, see, see, man. But uh, Lucy did say she didn't think that, you know, Cody meant, meant any harm to her. He probably was just trying to help out. I said, somebody got a brain. Some Gladys going to sit up here and try to flip the script and everything. But did y'all see the preview for this week's episode? If you didn't know, unless it's a holiday, every Monday at like, I think, 6 a.m., 6 a.m. Central Standard Time, they drop a promo on the General Hospital channel. They drop a promo for the week's episode, and they show Sasha Dante and them saying basically how they going to prove that Doc was been uh, injecting her with stuff or whatever. So, yeah, that's what's happening this week, y'all. But, uh, yeah, Nina kicked Lucy out. Meanwhile, Lucy, oh, my goodness, Blair was right there. I mean, she seen her at first anyways, but she didn't get to see her talk. So what did Blair do? Because she was like, she was looking to see where he went and everything. And I was like, what did she do? And what is she up to? Or whatever. And I said, Martin ain't going to be able to keep hiding this anyway, hiding who she is. All you got to do is research. And look, the internet tell her basically almost everything. Almost everything. All she got to do is research and she going to find it out. And it's not going to take her long to figure out this. Um that that's his uh, ex-wife as well as the fact that he gave her the idea he stole that lady idea he stole blair idea and i said man see look i don't think did he try to deny it i don't i don't think he tried to deny it i don't know but i said so you did steal it so why not go after him make him give you back 350k you going after lucy when you just admit it like i don't know if she think if blair think that lucy knew about it or what 
but it can't be because she was telling him basically trying to make a deal with him and stuff so it's like okay why you ain't going out you don't cost these folks costing these folks their company and everything and you know that he's the one who stole the idea or whatever i guess because his name ain't on it it's lucy name and everything but yeah uh, they don't met up she trying to make a deal i said how's she gonna make a deal a side deal with him so that uh you know she won't have to continue paying him 50k when tracy over here made her own little deal i said they both trying to make deals uh-uh uh-uh Stella and Elizabeth was just talking about, you know, the hospital and Felicia coming to work with them. I think, did she talk about that with her? Or did she talk about that with Marsha? Yeah, but they ain't, then Marsha ended up come tell Stella that um, Curtis considering selling the, the uh, club and everything. Woo supposed to be back tomorrow. I said, oh my goodness. I really thought they was going to do a big storyline with Woo to reveal she was the one after Sunday. But now it's, they done made it so whoever uh, did that, they got Curtis uh, paralyzed was actually at the Anna. Like so I'm like, man, so what? What is Wu <laughs> what is Wu gonna do? Like she ain't up to nothing. She ain't working with Pike. I mean like what? Like I thought her storyline would have been bigger by now. Um Elizabeth and Finn was talking about Gregory and now they saying like I didn't understand because y'all know I'm always they be confusing me. <laughs> Cause um Elizabeth presented the idea that maybe the dogs didn't value his patients or give them the treatment that they deserve so i'm like is you saying that he was misdiagnosed or are you saying that he just ain't treating you know him uh carefully and all that and making sure his time left on this earth and everything is good like what like what is it or whatever so now fans will be looking into different doctors and presenting the idea to gregory and everything i said they probably gonna save gregory i said they probably gonna save it um by the time they get ready to tell chase or he gonna get too sick because he got sick on today's episode and uh chase was just talking to brooklyn about um her family his family i said her family his family and everything about how they get along and honest with each other and all this other stuff brooklyn was crying to chase about she lost her best friend and i said well, you well you knew that you knew that and chase was basically saying like maxie done did this and that in the past she should know and all that i said that's true I said, that's true, but you can't, no, you can't throw people past in their face when they sit up here. Now, if they still doing the same stuff, you ain't got no choice but to bring it up because you still doing the same stuff. If you didn't want me to continue talking about it, you shouldn't be still in that same area, duh. <laughs> but yeah, he brought it up. What she done did? I said, she did. Maxie used to be doing so. Look, every time turn around, but now she seemed like she got better. I mean, the time we do see her. So he was basically trying to con her and everything. And I was like, she going to have to find a way. She gonna find a way to get back in their good graces. She might end up finding out more information about what's going on. Finding out that Martin was the one who stole the idea, uh, flipping the script. We don't know. We don't know how far it's gonna go. Gregory ended up having a conversation with Ismay because she was in her feelings because she thought Spencer trusted her. We've been spending all this time together. Shut up. You just trying to get your man back. <laughs> you don't care nothing about that. You just trying to get your man back. But did y'all see the spoiler? Um, what did he say? um i want to say nicholas but uh, it's something pertaining to nicholas i think um he's supposed to reunite with somebody at first i thought they said alexis but then they changed it it's no longer up there it's something else some i said something else somebody else who was it who was connected to nicholas it was it spencer i don't think it was spencer it was somebody else they said he's supposed oh ava ava i said do y'all think he's gonna reveal himself to ava already but i mean it's about time i ain't gonna say already it's been some months now so yeah they said it's something about ava sees gets a visitor uh that she least expect or something like that alexis and finn was talking about uh i think they was talking about gregory wasn't <laughs> Shoot, they shoot some of these folks scenes be so boring i i look i just stopped taking notes i write their names down now and try to force myself to remember uh the scenes and what happened and stuff um but for the bold and beautiful i usually jot down like notes or whatever because it's so it's short or whatever but general hospital it's like 40 minutes long so look everybody and their mama be on there <laughs> so i was like i don't know but yeah, I'm ready to see. It's some interesting stuff going on on General Hospital, though. So we'll see, y'all. But comment down below what y'all thought of this episode. Stay tuned for more videos. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. Also, again, make sure you check out my store. The link is in the description. Sign up for um, my motivational group, the DLC Crew Takes Club, for $5. It's on sale for $5. Four encouraging messages per month until the end of December. They will be sent at random to motivate you. Until next time, do this. Have a great rest of the day and be safe.